that's why the 4G is so good in Slough Bottom Park. And by the way, the bin was emptied. It's nice. That's one for the rain on the van roof crowd. It's gone quiet now. saying, I need to do my own research. We're not out of the woods yet, though they're lovely dark and deep. We have miles to go before we sleep. But, to quote the great poem, saying I'm not essential, you're saying I'm supposed to roll over an addiction die? I'm going to study you. I'm going to find out who you are. I'm going to find out how you took over. And I'm going to stop complying with it. And I'm going to win. Because the children deserve it. Oh, yes. Say something to the lovely Ooh. viewers. <laughs> I'm lost for words. <laughs> I was going to say, um, what was it? Uh, Cats of Kings. I've forgotten the first bit of your phrase. Uh, tardiness is the discourtesy of retards. Tards, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man Happy Monday is steak night. Someone has gone to a lot of effort to create this. Yeah, this wall display. Yeah, with downlit LEDs. I mean, simple props, but they've just made it look so good. Need to empty that bucket of used wipes. And a procedure I haven't filmed very much is the uh, going to bed time procedure. Uh, so, obviously that means all the stuff that isn't bedding is in the front yes van tidy 13 is not complete and for some reason i've wriggled in the night and managed to dislocate the duvet cover from the duvet and uh, i was wearing trousers and a shirt today so uh, if anyone's really curious, <laughs> this is how a middle-aged man 
takes off a shirt in a micro van. Cuffs. <laughs> pull back the shoulder, pull on the left cuff, arm free. The rest is easy. Hmm. It's still clean because I was wearing a vest under that, so that goes back in the shirt drawer. Um, trousers. Well, it's a family show. Won't be showing that. Uh, yeah, T-shirt off. And I found another angle for my camera. So that made it a lot easier. And then, well, this is new to me. So I don't know, I guess I'll have the duvet cover closer to me than the duvet. And just, uh, <laughs> I guess that's it. <laughs> good night, Grandma, good night, John Boy. <laughs> oh, no, my feet. Missed my feet. Oh. Yes, nailed it. <sighs> So I'm beginning week four of my IT apprenticeship job and Sai has offered me what we call in England the full English breakfast. What? That's one meal for tenner. Enjoy. Thanks. Everything okay? Yeah. Oh. Ah, the simple pleasure of water on my skin. <laughs> And you don't dry your hands in the hand dryer. And that's what my luxurious lion's mane is for. That's twice in 12 hours. I've eaten there and used their bogs. Of course, never put your seatbelt on until you've reached second gear. <sighs> Picket fence. <clears throat> middle-class suburbia <sighs> do you know what I don't miss it <laughs> So for tonight's evening meal, 
is meat with four veg, namely okra, carrots, peas, broccoli, and under all that is a marinated lamb shoulder in a red currant honey and rosemary glaze. Something I find handy is this sunflower oil spray. It stops the vegetables burning, keeps them at a nice hot temperature. That is 200 Celsius or gas mark 5. And it means there's hardly any oil to spoil the gravy. Inverter on, 200 Celsius with gas mark 5, and just leave that on for 35 minutes. <sighs> While I watch hour two of the Alex Jones show on bitshoot.com. If you think the news isn't telling you what's going on, check out that channel. I can't link to it because YouTube will censor it. There is Bacton Terminal. Oh, wow. Northeast coast of Norfolk. Oh, that is thumbnail territory. Maybe I could get myself back lit in there. <laughs> Asian style. Oh no, can't say that. Nice. An absolute watercolour masterclass. Oh, yes. <laughs> 